Okay, we're gonna try here, another test. Pulse, chrono, 242, 248. Oh, this is, screen's not on, where's the screen? 268, 271, 275. 262, 266, 257. 272 on the hopper, 265, 266 on the chronos. 261, 259 on the chronos, 261 on the hoppers. 268, 263 on the chronos, 266 on the hopper. 276, 271 on the chronos, 270 on the hopper. They pretty much agree. I'm gonna take off the tip. 244, 242, nothing on the hopper. 204, 233, 228. 236, 233, 211. 229, 227, 204. 216, 238, 236. The hopper is consistently lower when you have a shorter barrel, so the barrel length appears to affect the velocity. 221, 228, 210. 231, 227, 209. 229, 234, 211. And just on these chronos, you get different readings slightly, especially because they're sitting uh, you know, side by side. You should be in line when you're taking your reading. You should be in line and directly under. Here's just a tuning fork. 121, 121, 121. So you can see, you know, when I take a tuning fork, I get a consistent reading on both chronos. So they're both reading the same. Just when the shots, you know, you've got the radars in different places, which is getting a different reading. 